Welcome back! Hey, hey, you guys! So this is obviously taking place immediately after. Mm -hmm. um, I, I, man, just like seconds ago, I really boned this level, right? Yeah. Seconds ago. Seconds. It was literally seconds ago. Seconds, like millions of seconds. <laughs> probably. I, I don't know. All right, so it's been like a, a couple weeks because I went to PAX and yeah. it was like a late night. And but I, I worked. A yeah, lot. A, a lot, a lot. Yeah. But what I else? have stories. What else PAX. did I do? I, I, you tell me. I don't know. What else did I do in the in the weeks? Oh, I in the years <gasps> in the year. Ooh, I don't know if I never knew about this. This no one's ever known it. This is brand new. This is the guys, guys. Twenty five years after the making of this game, we've discovered a new secret. No one's ever found that before. Nobody in the world. In the history of, of. No! Wow. Never mind. <laughs> Impressive feat. <laughs> Over. Um. All right. So. I have a story. So Dave went to PAX, that. and yeah. I, I pooped 17 times in the last two weeks, I think. Uh, I'm glad you count. Probably more than that. I'll, I'll keep better track. Uh, I'll, I'll start keeping track. I used to write oh. on, on a friend's Facebook wall while he was overseas. I would, uh, like, we made a deal that while he was overseas, he was gone for a year, that every time I took a poop, every time I took a shit, that I would write on his wall and describe it as a science experiment. Did and you legitimately do I this? I legitimately did this, and I would write on his wall, like, this went on for months, I would write on his wall every, I mean, I didn't do every single time, like, we, that's what we said, but I would write, like, you know, experiment number four. Yeah? The consistency of toothpaste took a while to progress the experiment. Oh, so you were just writing in a way where you didn't know it was poop? Exactly, I would describe in detail the shit that I would take, but hidden as like a science experiment. I never knew about board. this. No, I don't know if you're friends with this guy, but uh, that sounds. Like, did anyone ever figure it out? No one knew. Some people would like it. <laughs> Some people would like that. I didn't know would like my post. Like your parents would like it too, and yeah, like, mm. yeah, my parents would like it, or like his parents would like it, or just strangers to me would that like it. That is incredible. And it was just delightful to me because people were just liking. Ah, fire! So the poop consistency. Right. Hidden. Oh, well, uh, I don't know if it's worth it. Ooh. Goddamn right. Those it's worth skills. It. Look at me. Yeah, I get the star on the right, though. Oh, uh, what? So, all right, I got a pack story about. Uh, where, 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 I why, think what? Why? What? Star on the right. It is on the right. You went to the left. I no. Do you what? What do you what? Left. I went to. I. This is the right. Yeah, I said star on the right, and you went to the left side. Now you missed the star. It's cool. What in it. the name of Nicolas Cage are you talking about? It's on the right side, right under the right one. See? Okay, when you said that I went, oh my god, that I went left, I thought you were referring to something else, so. Uh, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> you did that exact same mistake last time. Wow, well, that was gr good timing. I just timing. lost every. Oh my god. Oh! No. Alright, so. so. Backstory for you. Backstory. Alright. Oh. Okay, cool. My life is in your hands. I right also, now. yeah, I'm the one who presses start for Zeb. <laughs> oh, he cannot control. I can just be like, end his life. Thank you, oh Lord of Game. End his life. All right, so I was at Pack South, and the final night, we all get this grand dinner together at Luciano's Pizza. Actually, it's Luciano's Italian restaurant. Luciano's is one of the most Italian names I can think of. Yeah, it's super Italian sounding, and it had. We gone there a different night, and one of the guys who was with us, Oro Boro. He's a big, uh, he's a Twitch Dark Souls streamer. He was hanging out with us, but he's like super. Oh my! Wow, we are playing awful right Dave, now. I made it farther than you at that level. All right. So point is, I was distracted by the story, which is about to get ridiculous. Mushroom house, mushroom house, mushroom house. All right. Ooh, so oh. we're at Luciano's, Luciano's Italian Pizzeria. Lu Luciano, what have I got to do to get some Luciano? It's obviously where the Godfather took place. They filmed it in San Antonio, Luciano's. This is in San Antonio, Texas, by the way. It's at Pac South, San Antonio, San Antonio, Texas. Luciano's was our second night getting it in a row. Because the first night, Oroboro is super picky. He'll only eat pizza, basically. So where can we get pizza? Italian restaurants. So we go to Luciano's again. Oroboro orders pizza once again. That was my bad. Oroboro orders pizza once again. I order, like, pasta. And everyone's ordering different foods. And, you know, we're having fun. It's our last night at PAX. Who's amazing oh, at that? Oh, shit. Who's amazing at that? Oh, shit. Horse shit. Horse? Oh. Yeah. Let me describe it in scientific terms for you on your Facebook wall. Yeah, yeah. All right, so. That's the key. Ew. Mm. Dem Facebook posts. Uh, okay, so. 
we all get this delicious food, and it's, all, it's really good. I get like a penne arrabbiato, which is spicy Italian, uh, or spicy, spicy sauce, spicy Italian sauce with my, my delicious penne pasta. That again, that again. I don't want to and that night I'm hanging out with one of them. I'm, I'm slept over at one of their hotels just so we could hang out longer. Like really good night, talking to them for a while. But I mean, we also played a drinking game that night and we're drinking for a while, like a bunch of us. But you know, some of the, some people were feeling out of it. It was the last night we've been at PAX for a while. You know, you, you kind of start to feel out of it after a while. And they decided not to drink because they just were feeling out of it. So some people weren't drinking the final night, but a bunch of us were. Next morning, we we're all like, okay, for whoever isn't leaving, Ouroboros was leaving on a plane the next day, so he's not joining us. But everyone who, oh god, you can, gra yeah, don't. But it's gonna pop up again at you. Oh, you just wanted to fake us out like you were gonna go for the coins. You're like, well, just kidding. You know, I wanted to. Go ahead. All right. So. Next morning, Ouroboros is gonna go on a flight back early, everything, and the rest of us who remain are gonna get breakfast together. So, you know, we go to have our final breakfast together, and I go down with, like, right after the guy who I was rooming with who took a shower before me. I was, you know, I'll let him go first so I could take a later shower and get that extra five minutes of sleep. Did he poop in the shower? Yes, it was awful. Oh, no. Was close, though. So, what we get down and we find out... Oh, that's where you died. All right, so we find out that one of the guys who we were with, right when we get down, had literally in the room right next to us, had woken up at six in the morning and started nonstop vomiting all night in the toilet. Like oh nonstop God. vomiting. For, at, for what, why? For like hours, we, we didn't know. You just, you woke up at six in the morning and started nonstop vomiting and just was feeling absolutely awful. We then get a text oh. from Ouroboros' girlfriend saying, hey, are you still at the hotel? Ouroboros not in a good place. We need help. So one of the guys goes up to check on Ouroboros, and apparently he was completely, completely out of it. Like, completely out of it, like, delirious out of it, gone. What, like, sick or drunk or fever or...? We don't, not, we don't know. But then it turns out that he woke up around 5 in the morning and just started... He couldn't make it to the bathroom. He was so sick and started projectile vomiting everywhere. Like, everywhere, and then vomiting in the sink. And someone had to go to clean it up for him, and the smell was so bad between the cleaning up stuff and throw up that the person who was supposed to clean up couldn't handle it. And his girlfriend had to do it for the hotel staff member, because the hotel staff member couldn't do it and started gagging. Well, don't they have masks? You, I, I don't know. I wasn't, I wasn't there. Oh. I was eating delicious breakfast. Oh. So then, like, everyone else is hungover, like, for the most part. I didn't, I was, I was trying to save money, so I only had one drink, but everybody else ordered a bunch of drinks, and we're drinking, and the one guy who didn't want to drink with us, it turned out he was also feeling pretty crappy, too, and we, we boiled it down, and we realized that everybody who was feeling bad had had the pizza at the Italian restaurant, Luciano's. Oh, no. And, and we also realized there was one other person who had pizza, who was the person I was staying with, and he was fine which was weird, and we then started to boil it down even further, and we realized the more you weighed, the less it affected you. So the lighter you were, it seemed to go in increments of how m little you weighed for so how horribly it affected you. So if you had eaten pizza, you, you would have been ruined. Yeah, I would have been absolutely obliterated. No, like, Ouroboros is even thinner than I am. So he, and I think yeah, the other guy who got sick and was vomiting was even thinner than I am too. But it was like, literally like going in increments of like, if you weigh a lot, like the guy who weighed the most wasn't affected at all. And then just went down and down. And Ouroboro was affected the worst because he weighs, he's the thinnest of everyone. So yeah, everyone got horrible food poisoning who had the pizza, which is weird because all they had was a margarita pizza, which is tomatoes, cheese, and bread. How do you get food poisoning from to tomatoes, cheese, and bread? Sorry, I made a fart noise. Tomato seeds. Did you start the timer? No. So, we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye!